After being down in the first set by 1-6, Alcaraz has come back really strongly. Can he take this away from Novak Djokovic? Waiting for the sixth game of Alcaraz in the fifth set. 15 years ago, Rafael Nadal in 2008 had beaten Roger Federer at the Wimbledon finals. Can another Spaniard, Alcaraz, do it today? Let's see. Yes, the championship point now. Come on, Alcaraz. Finding the first serve, and we'd certainly like another one here. He's done it! He's done it! It's a good revenge after that French Open loss. Woohoo! Deja vu! After 15 years, that day Rafa had climbed to his family and today Alcaraz is doing the same, I think. Yes, he has gone to his box. He's climbing up to his box. Just as Rafa's career is nearing its end, happy that got another Spaniard whom I can stand for. And 
stands the gentleman's singles champion for 2023, Carlos Alcaraz. that they've uh, played. These are the shots, or at least some of them, that will go around the world. They'll appear online and in magazines and newspapers, and they'll go down in history. Uh, a new champion at Wimbledon. I wonder if he knows what croquet is. Very, very generous with the changing room. As Novak Djokovic takes his leave of the court. And Jerry Armstrong, is that the acknowledged and congratulated by, by Novak Djokovic. He will know full well that Jerry is finished as the referee here after his four year stint. And just as Nadal would do in the old days, I guess with the trophy. Also with the presence of mind to stick his watch on, no doubt the sponsors will be delighted with him for that. Still wondering at least Mertens versus Sue Weishene and Barbara Stritzner. This is how this match finished. Four hours and 42 minutes. Subtlety, skill, endeavor. And, and this is what it means. There's my boy in the background, Carlos Alcaraz Senior. Brother there. Mom, look at me, Mom, I didn't see her. We're just rolling around on the grass on a Sunday evening. Just for the record, the winner of the tournament receives £2,350,000 plus some very, very significant sponsors' bonuses, no doubt. And the runner-up half of that money, but still uh, still tennis here. Ladies' doubles final is uh, on the way. It's always sad when the tournament comes to an end as far as the singles is, uh, is concerned. And the name... Is up. Careful now. We don't want to have to do this again. And there it is, revealed under the name Novak Djokovic. I wonder if they'll play further finals here. It would surprise no one. Well, what a remarkable final. One of the best, surely, in recent memory. And so much respect shared between the two competitors after well over four and a half hours of what was a truly remarkable match. And there is the name of the 20-year-old up on the board, the third Spaniard. On the male side of things, the win here at Wimbledon. So the match reduced to numbers. Total points one, two the difference. There you go. It's when you win them, and it's the approach you take at moments of adversity. Think about the first point of the game where Alcaraz was trying to serve it out in that ball drop shot. There's Ian, he's a handy player himself. He's finished his chairman now. His duties will be complete. Every time that I was waiting here to get the ball, I was, you know, watching the ball on the winner. As he makes his way through this back door into the club room. And here he comes. A moment every player dreams of.
had run this poll on Twitter earlier. That's it for tonight. Buenas noches and adios.